Hello, my little Jew lovers, and welcome to another vlog. Um, not a lot to talk about. I've got delicious cookies. Um, soon enough, fairly soon anyway, uh, my editor friend is finishing up his senior year of high school right now, which means that during the summer, I may finally start getting those Minecraft videos out that have been you know, stockpiling for almost a year now, maybe over a year. And I'm going to have him teach me how to edit things so that I can edit stuff on my own so that I don't have to uh, rely on him and his schedule. He's a fantastic guy, but our schedules are conflicting, and his is far more busy than mine. So, yeah. Um, other news, going into classes, or a class, for the summer, gonna try and get a job at work, at uh, GameStop. That'll be fun if I get it. I've also applied at a pet store and at Target, so we'll see what happens there. Um, not a whole lot to talk about other than that. I'm trying to figure out which game I want to play next. I've gone through a very a, a select few recently. Let me take a look at the list. Actually, I've started playing a little bit of Chivalry: Medieval Warfare. I've gone through both Dragon Ages, I've played through a lot of Fable, The Lost Chapters, um, I've tried a little bit of King Arthur 2, the role-playing war game, which kind of sucks, I'll be honest. Um, let's see, I got Supreme Commander recently, tried that out some, and I know there were others, hold on, let me see if I can dis rediscover them. Let's see, Chivalry... No, I guess that's it. But those games have been occupying a lot of my time, and I'm kind of... I want to play something, some sort of fantasy role-playing game, where I get to customize my character to an extreme. Like, I want him to look exactly how I want him to look. You know? Um, <coughs> pardon me. There was a time when I was uh, really into Star Wars, The Old Republic, and uh, I took a break from that, for a while, because I had discovered DC Universe Online, which has great character customization. It's not intensely detailed, but one of the things I really like about it that bugs me about other RPGs is that once I pick up a piece of equipment in DC Universe Online, I can wear it or not, but even if I'm not wearing it, I can choose to make it look like I'm wearing it. Like, I'll pick up item A, let's, let's skip this back a little bit for a demonstration, I'll pick up item A, but item B is better. I'll wear item B, but if you look at my character, it looks like it's wearing item A. That's like style customization, which I like. I like that. I can make my character look whatever, however the fuck I want him to look without having to worry about the stats, which is nice. Um... Usually RPGs just handle that by making the better stuff look cooler, but people have different definitions of what's cool, right? Um, anyway, so if anyone who watches this video, either one of you, uh, knows a good game where I can uh, customize <sighs> my character to an intense extreme, and maybe, maybe not something like uh, Skyrim, because I, I know people love those games, but it's a little too open for me. I, I need a little bit of direction. In Skyrim, I look at that and I just see walking around for hours in an open, empty world, trying to figure out where I'm supposed to go next. You know. Um, preferably something for the computer. Uh, I don't know if... Well, Saints Row the Third should be online, but... Yeah, anyway. I am burpy. Chocolate chip cookies and Dr. Pepper, I swear to God. I am one ball of belch. Um, but yeah, so I think that's it. Any suggestions, I would be welcome to them. And until next time, shalom. One second, there we go.